Hello everyone, I hope you're all well. Today I invite you to come back in time with me to Bath, to September, to when Ben and I did this trip to Bath and then I lost interest in editing the footage, despite it being one of the best trips we've taken together, I think ever. We had such a lovely time and I have this thing where if I don't do something immediately, it no longer exists. I have no interest, even though I really had so much to share with you about this trip and places and um, even just Topping and Co Bookshop, which is now, I think, one of my favourite bookshops of all time. Um, I really hope you enjoy the video, um, but I'm just sad that it's taken me this long to share it with you because it, it was such a long time ago now. Bath is one of my favourite places in the UK. I always feel really at home there whenever I go. And it was actually the first place Ben and I ever went, like, as a little mini break as a couple. Um, and so it kind of has a special significance for us. But it's also where both of us, we both put bath spa down as our kind of reserve choice at university so the romantic that i am i always like to think that even if we didn't meet at york st john we would have met at bath even though i know that's not how life works but there is a part of me that kind of thinks it um so bath is quite a special place for us but it's also just one of the most beautiful places in the uk and obviously has so much literary history with jane austen it's one of those places where you really feel like you're in a period drama whenever you're walking around because of all the beautiful architecture it's also home to so many lovely bookshops and we went at such a glorious time of year when everything was starting to come a little bit more autumnal um so i really hope you enjoy the kind of the snapshots i guess of this trip <music>
of our trip to Bath. It was definitely, I think, one of the best trips that we've kind of taken to go in quite a long time. Um, so I hope you liked the little bits of footage and also the books and the tea. Um, so thank you for watching. And because you're at the end of this video with me, I think it seems right that you leave either a cup of tea emoji or a book emoji. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon in another video.